Hi everyone, Combook Reviewer here. This time reviewing on the Powerpuff Girls movie. Now, as you know, the Powerpuff Girls was created by Craig McCracken, the same guy who's worked on Foster's Home for Imaginary Friends and Over Yonder. Now, the movie is meant to be a prequel to how the girls are created, how the professor come, comes to his role as a, as a father. Now, the film is mainly served as a prequel before the TV series, how Professor Utonium lives in a crime-ridden city with fear, violence, and intimidation. Now, pretty much, he ends up creating Blossom, Bubbles, and Buttercup, and later finds out that they have superpowers. Yet, it never comes to Professor Utonium to help train them and help make them better superheroes. Because, one, he allows them to go out into school, and after a serious game of tag, causes world-spread panic and destruction. I mean, if I was Professor Utonium, I would train the girls, teach them certain things about stuff, and to make sure that they don't get carried away. Now, of course, this causes the townspeople to fear and hate what they don't understand, and treat the girls as if, as if they're the villains. Now, at the same time, you have Mojo Jojo. Now, before becoming Mojo Jojo, he was known as Mojo, and was originally the professor's pet monkey. Now, pretty much, he ends up manipulating the girls, and helps them to create a whole monkey army sort of style villains. Now, it's also up to the girls to help fix things, and hope make things right. Now, what I think of the movie, it's actually pretty good, and actually does serve well as a prequel. Now, there are also some deleted scenes that never got added into the movie. For example, Paul, for example, like the townspeople who are having a more childish reason for suing the professor. Also, certain other elements where the girls are helping Mojo Jojo build the base and so on. Now, unfortunately, the movie didn't really prove a big success. And this caused other certain films like the Samurai Jack film being planned to be shut down. Now, personally, I do think this would have served better, in my opinion, as a television prequel. Because originally, Craig McCrack and the others had planned to do a Powerpuff Girls episode called Deja Vu, which, which would have had the girls head into a parallel universe to meet their evil counterparts. That was cancelled, and that was moved into a comic book book, which actually is quite popular. Also what's interesting is that there was a lot of promotional material for the Powerpuff Girls movie. There were like, posters, trailers, everything else. Now it's actually quite an enjoyable film, and I do give it a good thumbs up. Craig McCracken does know how to handle a Powerpuff Girls movie. And it's definitely good. So, comment review here. Signing out.